Well, new at six, traveling to Orioles games just got a lot easier. The new Camden station is officially open to riders. Pat Warren reports it is one of the Hogan administration's transit improvement initiatives. Baltimore has a new gateway founded in American history. The original Camden station was built in 1856. A Blinken stopped here on his way to his inauguration and again on the trip to deliver the Gettysburg Address. One, two, three. And no sooner was the ribbon cut than it had its first visitors in town from Toronto for the Orioles game. It's a lot cooler in here than it, it is, is beautiful in here. Sure, yeah. <laughs> nice, nice day to be in air conditioning. This is, for many people, their first introduction to Baltimore. And we want to present the very best face we can, and I believe it does that. Is this your first visit to Baltimore? Yeah, absolutely it is, yes. So, so far we've made a good impression. You yes, have. Yes, yes. <laughs> and then for those people who need to use this as a transit hub, uh, it's much more inviting and comfortable for them. So this is a big win all the way around. MDOT MTA is one of the largest transit systems in the country, operating light rail, marked train service, subway, local link, and commuter buses. And I believe that we've been very successful over the last five years in putting the resources we have into that balanced transportation network of transit and highways. The ribbon cutting is ceremonial. The true test is practical whether it meets the $7 million level of satisfaction the state intends. I'm Pat Warren reporting for WJZ.